ready to become superhuman? Yes. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. Okay, so what we're going to do today is look at various different ways that we can efficiently fuel this beautiful body we've got. Okay, and that's it. It's all about efficiency. You run anything efficiently and it lasts a long time. Same with your car, same with your body, same with anything. Okay, so we're going to look at efficiency and not stressing our body out. So we're going to whisper to it and love it and it's going to love us back. What happens when you wake up in the morning? What's the most important thing you put in your body? Oh my God, you've been listening. Water. I like to hear you guys listening. So, water. You are 75% water. Yeah? This is the most important thing you put in your body. Yeah? Please. Hydration is the key to life itself. Okay? So, we're going to be very conscious about... Um, the power of water, things we need to watch out for. So we're gonna do a little demonstration on what I do with my water. In the morning, your body's always a little bit dehydrated. A lot of people will probably reach for the coffee, yeah? We've heard of things called diuretics, yeah? They dehydrate you. So coffee, you wake up dehydrated, you get even more dehydrated, and then we're borrowing money that we haven't got. So this is all about how can I put money in my bank in the morning, and then I can withdraw through the day. And that's what we're Connecting the mind and the body. The body's the vehicle, the mind's the driver. It's sending signals between one and the other. Hydration or electricity transport through water or hydrated bodies very easily. So it's about efficiency. Okay, so chlorine, fluoride, uh, the amount of pesticides and chemicals just in our atmosphere, even rain now. They say um, every drop of water on this earth has been in, come in contact with some form of chemical. Even the, they've just been in Denmark testing the fjords, the really low bottom ones, they found pesticides glycophate in there. Okay, so it's difficult, even if typically you've got a really nice spring near you, these pesticides have, have managed to get down to the lower, uh, through the rock formations and stuff. So what we need to do is we need to, um, take control of everything that goes in your body and water's the most important thing. So we're going to invest some time and effort into this beautiful liquid in four different states. Yeah? I've just got an amazing new research study called the fourth state of water. It's like a crystalline thing. So Masaru Emoto, very famous Japanese scientist, did crazy experiments with water. I'm going to send you a lot of information based on this stuff. Won't get too into it now. So this is distilled water in here. Okay? So my go-to water is distilled water. I've done a lot of testing on different waters and stuff, and the only really way to get through clean, pure water is through distillation. Yeah. It's a tabletop water distiller, $150. Uh, it does about 16 litres a day, it just drips out. So basically it's a kettle, it heats up, the water becomes a vapour, it has a condensing coil in here, and then it drops down through a carbon filter. One thing we've got to be careful is we've taken all the minerals out. Okay, so it's that empty water. Imagine distilled water as being a little bit like a bus that you can put your friends on and that bus can travel inside your body, yeah? Typically bottled water, tap water, spring water, any other sort of water, it could have some good and bad in it. The trouble is by looking at it, you don't know. I could give you a glass of water, two glasses of water, one full of poisons and one full of love, and you wouldn't know the difference. I'm gonna show you how I supercharge my water. Okay, so I've got an empty bus here. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is put in one of my favourite things, apple cider vinegar. This has so many benefits. One of the biggest benefits of this, it helps our body absorb nutrients. So what this does, it opens up the cells and lets the body absorb what you're going to put in after. So what we're doing, we're waking up in the morning and preparing our body for the stages we need to fuel ourselves up. So a little bit of apple cider vinegar um, helps lower stomach acids very good for weight loss, cholesterol levels, blood sugar levels. Make sure if you buy an apple cider vinegar, it is raw, unfiltered, and it's still got its mummy with it. Okay, so I've got the, the acidity level. It's got its mummy with the stuff in the bottom. Yeah, so it's all got the furry stuff in the bottom of it. That's alive, so it's, this has got living bacteria in it. So I would recommend using apple cider vinegar to try and uh, change all the other vinegars. So it's, um, Dressings, if you want to do uh, cleaning yourself, which we talked about the other day, but I'll send you some info on that. Next thing I want to do is get some good minerals in there. Mineral deficiency or our, our ability of not being able to absorb minerals is a real problem. Okay? So I want to take out all the crappy stuff that was in there and put in what I know are excellent minerals. These are ionic, I like a little bit like a fulvic acid. 
but this has got all the minerals we need in a very, very high potency. Okay, so I'm going to add a couple of squirts of minerals. Um, next thing I do, one of our biggest deficiencies is magnesium. Okay, so I like to add a little bit extra magnesium into mine. Magnesium's a basically if we come in acidic or stressed, it's what our body uses to create alkaline in, or bicarbonates to alkaline the body. So I like to add extra magnesium. This is the stuff that makes you happy. Okay, this is a uh, yeah, just amazing stuff. So I'm going to add. I heard as well. This one's from a place in Hawaii. Uh, you, um, this is an amazing company if you're an American. Um, also another little thing that I like to use, this is a bitter, so this is a purified version of apple cider vinegar. It gives even more balance to our acidity, alkaline levels and stuff. You can have a look at, help yourself to look at any of these funky things I'm putting in. Remember you don't have to go crazy with this, you could just put some sea salt in there to get your mineral balance. Uh, water has the ability to absorb um, solids and create energy or information. I like to put, so this is a, a spirulina and blue-green algae. The nutrient value of this stuff is absolutely mind-blowing. One teaspoon, about 10 kilos of organic veggies in one teaspoon. This is packed with B vitamins, absolutely packed. Okay, so I like to add a little bit in here. Uh, water transports it into the body very efficiently. So I'm going to add, I'm not going to put it in with that, because it's going to go everywhere. So we're just doing an example. So basically water is, Transport. This has got a lot of chlorophyll or plant blood in as well. A red beet extract and spirulina. This is, a, look at that colour of that. That's natural plant colours. Yeah, all these dark reds and purples packed with antioxidants, okay, to combat our daily mad lives. Supercharge as much as possible. This water is going to absorb all this information and get that information efficiently into our body. Today we've got blue water. Every day my water is a slightly different colour. Okay, so what I've got in here is a very balanced hydrating fluid, uh, lots of minerals, lots of supplements in there. It's all been absorbed by the water, the energy's got in there, and then I can put it in my body. But before I do that, I'd like to add a little bit of fruit and soap. So this is OM, a tuning fork with the OM. So I'm going to do this. Tell my puts a lot of love in my water. So if you've never heard of Masaru Emoto, this will seem absolute madness to you, but I will send you some information. Water has the ability to um, absorb the positive energies around it. Okay, this might be a little bit out there for you. Okay, so who wants to try my blue water? Yes. But this, you take this in the morning, it's like drinking um, espresso. You'll feel your body getting hydrated. One lot of this in the morning, and you're starting off with a big chunk of change in the bank. Okay, so purple water this morning. Every day is a different colour. So help yourself to try a little bit. Remember it's important it is to get well hydrated. 1% dehydration, you can lose 50% of the ability of your body to function. Okay, so you wake up in the morning, to get your body prepared for what the day throws at you, is hydrate in a really, really efficient, way and you can supercharge it you know you don't need to go so crazy of this i use distilled water a reverse osmosis a uv filter invest in a good water filter this stuff is the source of life itself so this is the best investment you'll ever make Now you've found out a little bit about the Ultimate Healing Project, I'll see you soon.